All right, a uh, big and crispy alert. I'll be the judge of that. Jack's got a brand new fish sandwich, supposed to be big and crispy. Cue the intro. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I could be very persuasive. All right, we're back at Jack's. You know what time of the year it is? Uh, everyone coming out with their fish sandwiches. They have brought out the big and crispy fish sandwich. It is in this aluminum foil. Take me to your leader. Uh, let's just open it up. $4.99. It is protruding outside the bun, and we're going to give it a look-see. Whoa, that is a soft and fluffy bun. That is some anemic pickles, a small amount of lettuce. This review might go off the rails, but check it out. This is how it looks just right outside of the packaging. It is a nice size uh, piece of fish right there, but again, I'm going to show you what we're looking at. Where is all of the toppings? Hardly anything on there. I'm just going to show you what I see on the bottom of this. That is what I see on the bottom of this. Let's check it out. All right, check it out. Like I said, uh, $4.99 or $4.89. Uh, two measly pickles, hardly any tartar sauce, and then you're going to get hardly any lettuce. Now, I hope the fish uh, tastes amazing. We're going to go right into this section right here as the light kind of shines on it. Check it out upside down. The more you turn me inside out and round and round. Shout out uh, 80s musical group Rat. Uh, people seem to like when I shout out uh, Rat, so we did it again in this video. So, all right, here we go, the big and crispy, and will the uh, lack of toppings uh, affect the score? Let's check it out. The bun is really soft. Yeah, so you know you got a problem when the bun steals the show, and that's what you're getting on the inside. A decent flavor of fish, not getting so much of a crunch, and it is a really dry uh, fish sandwich. So, second bite. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to give the fish one taste on its own. There is a cross section of a piece of the fish. No crunch. Crispy, I should say. Big and crispy, not big and crunchy. Big and crispy, not too much crisp. Just a basic uh, fish sandwich. Washing down a fish sandwich with a Charlie cold brew uh, from Dunkin'. Not ideal. Not ideal. All right, so... That is a basic fish sandwich. I think it's overpriced for $5. You saw the amount of toppings that came on there. Uh, I am uh, very disappointed in that uh, fish sandwich. Uh, let's give it a rating. On a scale of one to 100, with one meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of... I'm going to give the big and crispy... <laughs> I mean, come on. Uh, from Jack's, a rating of... Ooh, 52. That is a 52, and I am sticking to it. Uh, yeah, so there you go. Another video in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word of my channel out to the masses. In closing... I just really don't think any other fish sandwich is going to compare to the Culver's uh, Walleye. I keep wanting to check it out. Uh, the name of this intrigued me, Big and Crispy. I'm like, all right, Jax, come on. What are you bringing to the table? Uh, but no, they did not bring much to the table. And uh, it is what it is. So uh, I gave it a shot and uh, failed.